And back to breaking news we told you about at the top of this newscast. Local families going to bed without power after strong storms knocked them offline earlier this morning. I want to show you the latest look at the Duke Energy outage map. You can see there are thousands of outages across the Carolinas. In Mecklenburg County, more than 8,000. Some families won't have power until Wednesday. Vanessa Rufus joins us with more. Power outages are never comfortable, but with nowhere to go and many of us working at home, this latest is on a whole other level. And it had gone in and out throughout the night before then, but then after five o'clock, it was like once the storm actually ended, my power never came back on. That was this morning, and Sabrina McCauley says by the afternoon, she couldn't stand to be inside any longer. So I'm gonna just go over to my parents' house. Um, right down the road, bring my daughter there because I'm not going to keep my three year old in a 85 degree apartment. The Matthews area mom is one of thousands hit with outages Monday. Duke Energy says across the Carolinas, more than 300,000 customers reported losses with more than 6,000 individual outage events. Duke says amid the coronavirus outbreak, crews have had to adjust how they work to suit social distancing and personal hygiene practices. But their staffing remains hardy, with even more workers coming from Florida to help. They will supplement the thousands of workers we already have in the Carolinas out in full force working to get customers restored. McCauley says she got her power back after more than 12 hours in enough time to save some of the food in her fridge, but not all. Yet another blow for the recently unemployed service industry worker. Groceries are like a treasure right now, and I just restocked my refrigerator, and a lot of that is probably bad by now. And Duke says that for some neighborhoods, assessment is still taking place, which means that power restoration efforts won't even start until tomorrow. And in fact, on the outage map, we are seeing some neighborhoods with an estimated restoration sometime in the middle of the week. In Charlotte, Vanessa Rufus, WCNC Charlotte.